Yoberhausen, here's another trick for you. As you can see here, we have the four aces. Now I'll show you that the deck is in a completely random order, like so. And to make sure it's really mixed up, I'll give it a shuffle. Just like this, taking any number of cards. Doesn't really matter how many, just as long as the order is completely random, completely jumbled up. Now for this trick, I'm afraid there will be a lot of dealing, but I'll try to do my best and do this as quick as I can so that I don't bore you guys. Okay, so I will now deal the cards out into two separate piles like this, using a magical rhythm. The name for my trick, yes I did actually make this one up myself, <laughs> anyway, it is named after the rhythm that I'm using to deal the cards. When I was at school, I took drumming lessons, and this is one of the first basic beats that they teach you to help your timing. Right, there we go, square up the piles, just like that. And as you can see here, I've ordered all the green cards over to the green aces. And the same has been done for the black ones. Now let's see if I can use this special beat further. I'll deal out this pile into two smaller ones. Up, down, up, up, down, up, down, down. Simple beat really. There we go. Square up the piles. And I'll copy that with the black pile. Uh, all this dealing is making me dizzy. <laughs> uh, anyway, I'll square up these piles. Now we will start over here by the diamonds. And yes, we have the two through king of diamonds. Next we move on to the clubs. And here we have the two through king of clubs. Then here we have the hearts. Oh, wrong way around. The hearts, two through king of those. And finally, oh, let's try that again. Finally, we have the spades, two through king. For some reason, I find spreading small piles harder than a full deck. Anywho, this is my performance of my own trick, Paradiddle.